Awesome. All right, welcome everybody. We're so glad you're with us. Welcome to our Building Beautiful Lives Tuesday night call. We do this um, every Tuesday night. We bring some incredible people to share their stories of how Monate has impacted them and their lives and their families. And we've got a really special guest tonight. Um, my name is Patty White. I, I'm here with Erin Henley. And before we start, if you are a guest and you have not already put your name in the comments, if you could do that, please put your first and last name and who invited you and we will get your name in the draw. We're going to draw for a Bee Balance moisturizer tonight, which is a very nice prize. So somebody's going to win that before the night is over. All right, you guys, I have a really amazing guest tonight. I'm so excited to introduce my, oh, sorry, hold on make sure I don't forget. <laughs> I have to set alarms all day long, you guys, because otherwise I forget what I'm doing. So I think it might be my age, but we'll just say that. Um, so I, I met this beautiful woman when we were in um, Dominican this year. We are both gratitude ambassadors for Monate this year. And it's such a really cool privilege for us to be able to do that. And it gives us the opportunity to um, work at different gratitude events at when we go on trips. So um, this one particular event, we had a baseball team from the Dominican and we had brought a whole bunch of equipment and we got to have lunch with them. And that's where I got to meet Dawn. And um, we have a lot in common and she is just a superstar at this business. So she is a mom. She's got two boys. They are 23 and 20. She's been married for 27 years, so same as me. And um, she is a real pro at this business. So she's gonna share with you a whole bunch about why this has, how it's impacted her, but also her family. So, and she's a MMM, you guys, Managing Market Mentor. If you don't know what that means, it's okay. But for the people who are on the call who know, it's nice to know that. So I will introduce and let Dawn take it away. This is Dawn Hooker. Take it away, Dawn. Thank you, Patty. Thank you, Aaron. I am honored uh, to be here with each and every one of you. Can everyone hear me okay? Okay, awesome. I always like to ask, you know, technological challenges, right? So Patty and I do have a lot in common. Um, we're about the same age. Uh, we started our business about the same time. We have, uh, you know, grown children um, in college or in their new careers. And we just hit it off in the Dominican Republic at our gratitude event. And that was our first big gratitude event as a new ambassador class. So those of you that are guests on the call, gratitude is what we do. It's, it's, it's not really what we do. It's actually who we are and what we do to give back. So every time there's a trip or a conference or a Monate local event, we incorporate gratitude in giving back and helping others in everything we do. So there's about 35 of us gratitude ambassadors um, in the company around the world. And we're there to help the gratitude department uh, with social media, with ideas, with getting the message out and with giving support. And it is truly an honor to be a part of it. So those of you that are market mentors or higher, July, you're gonna be able to apply for the next year. And I recommend you do that. Apply for it, get to know the gratitude program, get involved, it's absolutely amazing. And those of you that are not that level or higher, not able to apply, make sure that you participate in our give back programs that we do. So as Patty said, I'm John Hooker. I'm from San Antonio, Texas, wife, mom, volunteer, um, monate, uh, market mentor, managing market mentor, and, and market partner for life. I absolutely love this company. So I'd love to share with you a little bit about my before, how monate has changed my life, and where I feel uh, my life is going and what I'm grateful for in this business. So before Monate, I was actually with a different company for almost 15 years. And it was a little bit of the old fashioned direct sales. And it was an amazing company with skincare, cosmetics and spa treatments. And we did in-home parties. And my boys were little and I did love it. Uh, but I did two to four parties a week, carried inventory, 
worked my buns off. Um, I was an executive director. Um, I did very well in the company and I built it up. And then that company closed. I was devastated. I thought, what now? You know, I'm in my late forties. What am I going to do now? Right? So I prayed about it a lot. My husband and I did lots of research. I started a day job in the travel management industry. I was their director of communications. And I started doing money on the side as a supplement in a plan B. And honestly, I believe everyone needs a supplement, plan B, extra stream of income, especially during COVID and now going forward. So um, I fell in love with the product. I fell in love with the family and the owners and what they stood for and what this company has done. And I fell in love with the atmosphere and the culture of money. And so I worked alongside of my job and I would do this from my phone, sharing products with my friends and family and beyond. And I became a market mentor and earned my Cadillac and several trips while working full time. So those of you working full time, you're thinking, how can I do this? I promise you can. Whoever invited you will show you how, I promise. And, you know, then COVID happened. And I was like, okay, how is this gonna go? We don't carry inventory, thank goodness. We don't have to do the home party thing if we don't want to. During COVID, we couldn't do that, right? Um, how's this gonna work? Okay, well, it ships directly to my client. I don't have to worry about making deliveries. Uh, people are still gonna shampoo their hair, even though we're in lockdown, right? So my business actually quadrupled during COVID, thank God. But my hours in my day job went down to 24 hours a week, was working from home. And then my boss, love her to death, we're still friends today. I'm still a part of her um, charity that she, she founded that benefits the Batter Women's Shelter here. Um, she said, Dawn, I've kept you on as long as I can. Nobody's traveling. And I was like, okay. And you know, it was like God whispered in my ear and said, it's okay. You've got Monet. You have this, this family, you've got this culture, you've got these other people you can reach out to the positive atmosphere. You've built this business. Now you have time to do this business more, right? So I was able to take it to another level and promote up to managing market mentor during COVID. So my point is, you never know what's going to happen in any industry, right? Any job. If anything, COVID taught us no one is safe, if you will, right? Anything can happen. Life can happen. But we can have a plan B. We can have something that we look forward to, that we have fun with, that we share with others. Um, a way to give back, a way to make a difference, and a way to help our families. So I'm gonna look at my notes because I don't wanna make sure I get off track here. All right. So, and you know, the other thing that was so great, um, this time last year, April last year, I had a major surgery. I lost my job, my day job. My business was doing well. I could do my business from this or social media, phone, Zoom, right? But a year ago, April, I had to have a major surgery that I needed downtime with uh, no lifting, no strenuous exercise for about eight to 10 weeks. The life, where else could I have done that? You know, and not, it not, not had a paycheck, right? I still had my paycheck. I still had my team. I still had my clients. And I was able to focus on my recovery and not be stressed like I used to be about, you know, living paycheck to paycheck and things like that. I was able to focus on taking care of myself and healing and moving forward. So I actually worked from bed <laughs> during that and, um, you know, paced myself and was able to heal. 
So that's another great thing about this business is the flexibility and not having to ask off and being able to take care of family members or take care of yourself. So that's a little bit about before and my start in money and how has my life changed? Well, this company is so positive. I love being around the culture, the positivity, the uplifting, um, the personal development when we have our conferences and the speakers and, oh my gosh, Tony Robbins is going to speak at our conference. I've always wanted to see him in person, right? In St. Louis in September. And that's something that, you know, I might not have had opportunity to do, right? And so they pour back into us and want us to have very successful businesses and great lives and to take care of our families and be all that we want to be. I'm actually the mom, the wife, the person I want to be. I can still volunteer. I can take time for my family and myself and still have this amazing business. Um, the income opportunity um, from my previous company to this company, I had never seen a compensation plan like Monate. And um, the extra bonuses and uh, the fact that our company gives 50% back to the field, that is unheard of. Most companies are 25, 35% maybe in their compensation plan back to their consultants or partners. Um, I see my future as being bright, as being one of um, being able to help people in return they'll help me. The, the more I help others succeed, the more I'm going to succeed. Um, I love to travel. So those expense paid trips are pretty darn nice. Um, so I'm looking forward to those in the future as I have in the past. Um, I'm looking forward to the legacy and the financial freedom that I continue to give to my family um, and to ourselves. And you know, guys, the way I look at it, I heard a statistic, and I don't know, remember where I heard this, and I might have been from someone in Monade, I think it was, but if anyone wants, with the inflation, the way things are today, if you want to lead the same type of lifestyle that you did this time last year, you're going to need to make an extra 5000 or more dollars a, a year to just lead the same type of lifestyle you did last year, Okay. So what is your plan for that is my question to you. How do you plan to make up the difference? Because you gotta have a plan, okay? You most likely have a day job. Your husband has a day job, your partner, whomever. Um, maybe you're a single mom, maybe you're a stay-at-home mom, but what is your plan to make up the difference? And those are for essentials. That's not the extras. What is your plan? Because you can work from this right here and through social media and partner with us and have that plan and we can show you how. I mean, in Smart Start alone, your first three months, you can make amazing bonuses to go towards that if not beat that number, okay? So what is your plan to take care of you and your family? Because you know what? Monate can be your answer because it was my answer five years ago. And now in living paycheck to paycheck, working full time, going through COVID, losing my job, building my business and continuing to move forward. And I am so grateful for this opportunity. So grateful to all of you. And I know the future just is as bright as it can be. Thank you for having me speak today. That was awesome. Thank you so much, Dawn. Think about how much, you, how much you've gone through in such a short period of time. And I would venture to guess that most people on here have gone through similar things in a really short period of time. Like there's a lot of stuff because of the, la the way the last two years have gone that we've experienced like one thing after another that maybe it wouldn't have happened quite so compacted before. So let me ask you a quick question. Um, if somebody's thinking, you know, I would like to do something like this, but 
first of all, I have no idea where to start. I don't know how to sell and it's just not my personality. What would you say to that person? Like, is it okay for somebody to be like that? Is, is it possible to make an income doing that? Well, you know, Patty, I hear that all the time. And, you know, yes, I had a background of a previous company that was structured very differently. But I will tell you, in my opinion, anyone who has a desire and a big enough why can learn this business. If they're willing to partner up with you or whoever invited them and learn the little ins and outs, they can do this business. But the main thing that I want you guys to know, especially women and, and the men, of course, but the women, we're natural born sharers. Think about it. We share our favorite recipe, our favorite book, our favorite movie, Netflix binging, um, our favorite shoes, what's on sale. We're sharing it. So I want you just to transfer that thought of we're not selling, we're sharing. And I know what these products have done for my hair, which was dry, brittle, breaking off, would not hold color, wouldn't grow. It was awful. I'll show you. I have to post by before and after for you guys to see. Um, and what it's done for my skin and the wellness and everything um, that all I want to do is share it because I know so many people can benefit from it. Awesome. Thank you so much. That's exactly what I was, I was thinking exactly the same thing. We just love to help people, don't we? We all do. We love to do that. And that's really all we're doing. So, okay. I am going to um, hand it over to Aaron, but before I do, I don't think anybody else has come on the call, but just in case, if somebody new is on here, um, and you are a guest, please put your name in the chat, but I think I have everyone. So go ahead, Aaron. Okay. First, I want to thank Dawn. That was amazing. And I'm going to take, a, I'm going to make a little guess here. Even though you were seasoned in doing parties and things like that, do you think you grew during the time you've done Monet? Are you a different person? Do you think you would have given that same level of speech with the impact you gave? Um, before you started working in Monet? Probably not. Um, you know, yes, I had that experience. I had to, to learn, you know, this. Um, but I'm going to tell you, this is so much easier. <laughs> um, um, and the fact of no inventory and the low startup and the big return right away, there's nothing that beats it. But you're right, um, Aaron, the experiences, what this company has done for personal development for myself. Um, no, that confidence would not have been there five years yeah, ago. And I just wanted to draw that out because that is the transformation you see when somebody starts using Monade on their hair or their skin or their wellness. You can see that visually. Mm -hmm. The other thing you can see when somebody joins Monade as a business, the they won't recognize themselves in two, three years, and they didn't know they had the skills or the capability. They're sitting back on, I can't do that. I can't, but you know what? When, when my wife started this business, she hated to talk in a large group. And I wish you guys could have seen her um, in her last speech. <laughs> yes, she grew people. What a beautiful lady. Right. And people, this is what happens in the business. And I wanted, I, I wanted to, to just talk to that point that this business might feel like it's about um, sharing shampoo, which it, you know, it's about sharing shampoo. And by the way, the, the reason it feels easy is because everybody, you know, uses shampoo. And if they don't, they're probably not your friends <laughs> for very long, <laughs> but they all use some form of shampoo. And the minute they all use some form of shampoo, you don't have to convince them to add this great new thing into their life. It's just a new version of a thing they already are confident they need in their life, right? So that's how come sharing with Monate becomes fairly easy for people because you are sharing. You're just talking about stuff that you love. You're talking about stuff that has transitioned 
yourself and things like that. And it becomes very an easy, natural conversation. And then the more you do it, this incredible transformation happens on you. But what I wanted to talk about is when Roxy started this business and she grew to the top of the comp plan. And again, she just wanted to make 500 bucks a month, pay off one bill, add one bill, wanted to see her adding value. She was a stay-at-home mom and she wanted to come out of that and start to add a different kind of value to the family. And so the, the one paying one bill would have been great. And the next thing you know, she's ranking up in the company, gets to the top of the comp plan, um, starts making double my income. I was an executive in uh, tech companies and she doubled my income. And we're living this really complicated, horrible existence between 500 miles away with our dream home in Canada that Monet helped us build and uh, an apartment that we ended up getting in Chicago so we can see our grandkids and she's living there. I'm living here mainly. I'm driving back and forth and traveling all over for my other job. And then she goes, why are we living this complicated life? And I want everybody to take a moment and think about what it is about their life that are they at the spot in their life they plan to get to? You know, you sit back and say, one day we're going to have that home. I'm going to spend all this time with those kids. Or I'm going to have that home, that lake home, where we can go on our summer vacations. Or I'm going to, whatever the answer to, or I'm going to is. Roxy said, let's change that. And she retired me from corporate America. I came home. I started working. My full-time job became helping her with the business and basically loving on her and loving on my grandkids. And I was able to do that for two years. And then she passed away. And what I realized more than anything that this was not a shampoo business. What we were doing and what she was doing every day was impacting other people's lives. And it became such a simple answer to me about what am I going to do after Roxy passed is I'm going to continue to help change people's lives. I want them to have great hair if that's what they need. And you know, people who, who are struggling with their hair, they want, they feel bad about it. And it's okay, but we can help or I want them to change their life. I want them to seek out that thing they say, one day I'm gonna. I want them to figure out what that is and I want them to seek it out and I want them to go find it. And I want them to find it as fast as you can because you don't know how long you got. Your kids grow up fast, man. Whatever that is, there's something there and the clock is ticking. So I, I'd love for you to join Monate but I'd love you more than anything, figure out what that thing is, make a decision to go get it as fast as possible. And if Monate is your answer, I know it can help you get there. And the market partner that got you there can help you. And this team that's on the call can support you guys together to get you guys wherever you want. Or worst case, just find something that will help you get there and go get it change your life and start as soon as possible. And that's what I come on here to say every Tuesday. Thanks, Patty. Thank you so much, Aaron. We so appreciate you sharing. Um, I'm just gonna change the view here real quick. Okay, uh, I just had to quickly take a quick glance at everyone. Okay, we're gonna do a quick draw, you guys. We, we are drawing for a um, Be Balanced Moisturizer and I have the names on the wheel. I'm gonna give it a spin and um, if for some reason this, if this isn't the right moisturizer, let us know and we'll get you the other one. It doesn't have to be the be balanced. So if you have dry, sensitive skin, talk to your market partner if you win it. Okay, Shannon. Shannon, oh, that's Amy's um, guest. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, congratulations. Okay, so you and Amy can figure out which one's best for you and then we'll get you that. And I wanna say thank you to Dawn, of course, for coming. So appreciate it. I loved the fact that we got to have a chat um, yesterday, really awesome. I, I would love to be able to just go have coffee, you know, if we live closer. And I want to thank everybody who came on the call. You're all wonderful. You guys are going places. 
We're so proud of you and we appreciate you coming and we will see you all next week. Have a great week, guys. Bye, everybody. Bye.